when I was 12 years old, my dad bought me a basic VEX starter kit. Uh, when I was about 15, I heard about the VEX robotics competition. And I took my robot to a competition and ended up winning all three events, and I was definitely pretty excited. The next year, I competed again, and I built a much more advanced and much more sophisticated robot. Um, I went on to the Worlds that year, and I did pretty well in the match. I was the top 10% of teams, and I ended up winning the Programming Skills Challenge with a score of 130, which that year was very good, the 2010 World Championships. Yes. After winning the World Championship Award, I came back and was able to raise um, about $11,000 over the course of about six months in order to compete this year. And in August of 2010, I started working on this robot, and my initial design that I drew up was very similar to this, but it had several key differences. Um, I had a double extending vertical lift, I knew I wanted to build that, and I knew basically how my drivetrain was going to work. But beyond that, I didn't really know for sure how I wanted everything to work. Uh, the high hang is when uh, your robot is touching the ladder, the ladder is a three foot high sheet metal and PVC structure in the center of the court. Uh, if your robot is high hanging at the end of a match, your team will get 20 points. And in this game, that's, that 20 points is very key. Um, I, when they first announced this huge challenge, I was sure that I won the high hang. I thought that it would be one of those things which separated the great teams from the good teams. events are the robot skills, that's where one driver controls one robot for one minute on the court and he can score as many tubes as he can of either color. Then there's the programming skills, which is where one robot is on the court for one minute and can score as many tubes as it can of either color, but there is no driver, it's fully autonomous. And then the third event, the tournament, is when two robots versus two robots face each other in a match. to the U.S. Nationals where I was able to score 85 in the Programming Skills Challenge and 120 in the Robot Skills Challenge. Both of those scores were the highest that anyone had ever seen to date and were considered very impressive. The robots just about ready for the Worlds. Uh, the Worlds will probably be the hardest competition that I've been to yet, without a doubt. There'll be the best teams from the world there, and they'll all be competing at their highest level. 